If you are looking for the best place to stay in Tenerife, then this video is for you. I have traveled around this beautiful island many times during my holidays and have tried out about 20 different hotels. I have put together this top 5 which will help you find the best hotel for your holiday in Tenerife. But before I present you these 5 nuggets, it is important that you know the main regions of the island because each of them has its own particular it is and will please you more or less depending on the activities you wish to do on the island. The south is the most touristic region of the island with many large resorts. It is also the area with the most sunshine throughout the year. It is recommended for groups of friends, couples and families. The atmosphere can be quite festive in the summer, especially in Adej and Los Cristianos. It is an ideal base for visiting the whole island. The north, east and west of the island are more rural and authentic. The coastline is dotted with small, friendly coastal villages. There are also the two main towns of Puerto de la Cruz and Santa Cruz which offer plenty of activities and things to see. These areas are recommended for those who love nature and are not interested in the touristy and festive side of Tenerife. Let's start now with this top 5 of the best hotels in Tenerife. There is something for everyone, but I think the first one will please anyone. It is so incredible. If you are interested in any of the 5, I have put all the details in the description with the best prices. Number 5. Hotel Botanico and the Oriental Spa Garden. This five stars hotel is located in the north on the outskirts of the charming town of Puerta de la Cruz. The rooms are all spacious and elegant, with balconies that offer a superb view of the sea or the hotel's tropical gardens. There is a truly natural and relaxing atmosphere, enhanced by the hotel's unique garden. If you like spa, then look no further. This is the hotel for you. It has three swimming pools, two saunas, several jacuzzis, steam rooms and offers countless treatments and massages. Three different restaurants await you for your lunch and dinner. I tried the Asian and the Italian and I can tell you that they are worth the diversions. If you are looking for a luxury hotel to relax, enjoy the spa, and be in close proximity to Puerto de la Cruz, then the Hotel Botanico and the Oriental Spa Garden seems to be an ideal choice for couples. And a little tip for the choice of the room, I recommend the one from the third floor with sea view. To consult the prices of this hotel and all the useful information I put you the links in the description. Number 4. Vinci Selexi Own La Plantation del Sur This hotel is the one I found most suitable for couples with children. It is located in Costa Dej, the largest resort on the island, and very close to the beach where many water sports activities are offered. The rooms are super functional and tastefully decorated. Those with balconies overlooking the sea are simply stunning. There are of course several outdoor pools, jacuzzis, and beautifully manicured green areas. The spa is also very good, although not as good as the previous hotel I mentioned. One of the strong points of the Vinci Selection is its restaurant, the Gourmet Canario, which proposes really excellent Canarian specialties. I really recommend this hotel if you want to spend a holiday with your children in Tenerife. Number 3. El Refugio Apartments and Villa This number 3 is not a hotel but rather a charming apartment complex on the cliffside. Just 20 minutes from Puerto de la Cruz and close to the village of La Matanza, these accommodations are like a little paradise on earth. A typical room superbly decorated and well equipped, a swimming pool with an incredible view of the sea and the tide volcano, and even a sauna. Added to that, the owners of the estate are surely the nicest people I have ever met on the island. As you know I am always looking for the best value for money accommodation and this one is just exceptional. I haven't found better in Tenerife. You only have to look at the comments of the guests to realize how special this place is. If you are looking for an authentic and not too expensive place to stay for your holiday in Tenerife, then there is no better place than El Refugio Apartments and Villa. Number 2. Ibero Star Grand El Mirador I couldn't do a top 5 best hotels in Tenerife without mentioning the Ibero Star Grand El Mirador. I have stayed in many hotels of the Ibero Star chain during my travels around the world, but I must say that this one particularly stood out for me. 
The decoration of the hotel and the rooms is simply magnificent, made of refined colonial style. The hotel is located in Costa Dej, close to many restaurants and the most beautiful beaches of the island. I have absolutely nothing to say about the hotel's services, everything is perfect. The spa, the swimming pools, the cleanliness, the huge rooms, everything is made to feel good, in a great luxury atmosphere. And what can we say about the restaurants which are all of a very high quality level? Of course, you will have to pay the price to spend a week in this palace, but it's worth it. Number 1. Royal Hideaway Coral Suites I have stayed in many hotels in the Canary Islands but this is definitely one of the nicest I have stayed in. This 5-star luxury hotel is adult only, perfect for couples, and I recommend it if you want to go on honeymoon in Tenerife. The rooms are ultra bright, with all the luxury and comfort you could wish for and decorated in a sea theme. The hotel's facilities include several outdoor pools, including an infinity pool with a panoramic view of the ocean, not to mention the view at sunset, which is just breathtaking. There is of course a very complete spa, several restaurants, and a breakfast buffet that I literally fell in love with. And what can I say about the kindness and professionalism of the hotel staff? They all deserve a raise as they are so attentive to their guests. Another strong point of the hotel is that it is located a few steps from the charming fishing village of La Calada, with many excellent fish restaurants and ideal for a short walk. Unfortunately, quality and luxury come at a price. The weekly rate is not cheap, but believe me, this is the best hotel in Tenerife in my opinion. If you want to check the prices of these five hotels, I have put the links in the description. Once you have found the perfect accommodation for your holiday in Tenerife, don't hesitate to watch my video on the five must-do activities on the island, believe me it's worth it. And if you know of any other hotels in Tenerife that deserve to be in the ranking I invite you to tell me all about it in comments. I hope that this top 5 of the best hotels in Tenerife will be useful to prepare your stay. In any case I wish you an excellent holiday, see you soon.